What is going on, everybody? It's the France Prize Pokemon, and we're here with our next episode of the Pokemon Emerald Randomizer Nuzlocke. We'll get into the gameplay here in a minute, but we did do some training here, and our dark type Pikachu named Fran got a really good move, I believe it was. Oh no, it wasn't you. But has Psycho Ground, um, I'm sorry, Psycho Boost, Boomerang, Steel Wing, and Tail. It was actually Vicky. Uh, Psyduck, which is a Psychic Fire, got Blizzard, which should absolutely be one of the best moves we could have for this team. Also has Iron Tail, Air Cutter, and Present. Then we have Mina, uh, Grass Electric Kangaskhan, which has been one of the, one of the, I'm going to just say it right now, one of the hardest Pokemon in this playthrough so far to level up. And it's got some weak stats or whatever, but it has Zap Cannon, Crunch, Stomp, and Rock Smash. Then we have our Electric-type Rita, who will be evolving in about three levels, so there's that. And it has Poison Sting, Extra Sensory Facade, which it had since the beginning, and Iron Tail. And then, of course, the MVP of the playthrough, Hugo the Ludicolo, who was a Bug-type with Razor Leaf, Poison Sting, Silver Wind, and Triple Kick. And then, of course, Hope the Mew. Dark Fire with Meteor Mash, Mudshot, Minimize, and Shockwave. We are on our way to help out May. I believe we will be taking on one of the evil teams for this generation. And I'm not really going to be using the bike as much because with the fact that I'm using a phone, it doesn't work too well. Do I fit you? What do you do? <clears throat> So I got Roar, which I'm not going to be needing. I don't need that, but thank you. Let's see here. Oh, there's you. I forgot to move Fran out of the top front of the party, but it'll be fine. And you have two Pokemon, and you have a Ninkata. Okay, that's good. That's fine. And let's try the Boomerang on this and see what happens. Okay. You can hit twice and did a good bit of damage. Don't be anything that's going to whoop me. Oh, you only got withdrawal. That's fine. That's fine. We'll take it out right here. And two shots will knock it out. Good stuff. Ow. Corsola. Uh, yeah, we'll move you out. And then we can hope back in. Hope is the only one who's not at 25 right now? Yeah. I believe everyone else is 25 or better. So we're going to hit you with the mud shot. See what happens here. Ooh, that is awesome. Hope is going to be very clutch. If I lose hope, this is going to be really hard. I mean, yes, of course, it's Mew. It's a randomized Mew with um, different stats and everything. But, okay, so that goes... I don't know about stats, but okay. So we did we did we did lose out on our encounter here. Bring Hugo in for now. So we this doesn't matter who this is. I'm gonna take these guys on. Get a double battle going. But yeah, generation three was the first time they brought in double battles, and then generation four they brought in or generation five they brought in triple battles and rotation battles, which didn't last very long. But there was a Roselia and a Trap Inch. Okay. Let's see what we get here. Uh, let me think here. We're gonna triple kick the um, him, and we're gonna blizzard them both. Missed, of course she did. Hit the blizzard, big blizzard. Okay, that's fine. I can't. Hugo can't escape. That's fine. Assist uses the block too. So they're stuck in here. That's fine. Triple kick the Roselia and hit the Blizzard again. Down it goes. And the Blizzard will take out the Trap Inch and we are good for this battle. Good stuff. Good, good stuff. Awesome. And two ladies are done. I think one guy over here is a person you battle, or is he not? Nope. 
Fazbear. Okay, that's fine. I don't need one of those, but that's fine. What is this again? This is the Lynette's house. Oh, that's the, yeah. And let's see what you got for me. Mm. You have us a double batter thing. Ooh, Jirachi. Hmm. That's a tough one. I've faced Jirachi before, I'm pretty sure. Oh, Silver Wind for the win! And Hugo will hit level 30, which is fantastic. A it. So yeah, we're gonna bring in Rita here, try and get Rita some experience, because I do want to get see what it's gonna evolve into for its third stage, since it went to a Cubone, it can go into something else. Extra sensory, amnesia, that's not good. I didn't do anything. We'll go to Iron Tail. That's a Thunderbolt. That shouldn't do anything, right? Uh, of course, you're gonna paralyze me. But I got the Iron Tail. Oh, sweet. Did nothing. Facade. That could be bad. Not really. Okay, that's fine. Just hit this and do something. And it does. Good. Out of here. So level 26. We have like two levels to go for Rita to get to what it's going to evolve into. Now, we do have a question of the day. And the question of the day is, what is your favorite shiny Pokemon? This is my second YouTube account I've ever had for Pokemon. And I used to do shiny reactions that I would put on YouTube. That, is, that of course, channel has disappeared. But what is your favorite shiny? Mine, of course, I have... I have one, I think, for each generation that I can think of off the top of my head, but right now I know Generation 2, Generation 2 is Azumarill, Generation 3 is, I can't remember, but Gen 4 is Shinx, Gen 1 is, I can't think of off the top of my head, I mean, Ponyta, yeah, Ponyta is Generation 1, 100%. You don't have to give me one for each generation, but what is your favorite shiny Pokemon? If I had to pick one out of every single one of them, it would be Shinx. It is. I just love the black and gold, uh, the black and gold ensemble. I think it's just great for that Pokemon. But let me know in the comment section below what you, what your favorite shiny Pokemon is. Okay, you're level thirty, so we're gonna switch you out, and we're gonna bring Hope in. Get Hope up now. Yeah, we'll get Hope up and we'll bring Rita in here and there. Are you up? Yeah, I was going to say. Let's continue the battles here. He is a trainer. A tamer. Oh boy, if I observe. Okay, that's fine. Nothing Hope can't handle, I hope. Much shot. Knocks it out, right? Yes, it does. Oh, no, it doesn't. But it's got some good damage there. Oh my goodness. And not roll out. Not we better hit this much shot and knock it out. I do not want to deal with a roll out. A roll out my plume could wreck my entire team. More than likely. Good. Good, good, good. Uh, don't want I don't want your number. Don't want you in the bogey nav. Come on, get the button where I want to go. That's a Torkoal. We could have had a Torkoal, but I decided to fish instead. Which is a bad idea. Not doing any um, encounters that way, unless it's something. That you need a secret, a secret base for. Going this way. Gotta go up here. We got a bunch of trainers to go for. And what do we have here? Who has this guy got? Two Pokemon, he's got a Hypno. Alrighty. I can deal with that. I hope. 
definitely have to rethink my strategy when it comes to my next um, randomizer, which will be Pokemon Leaf Green after the Pokemon Emerald is done. Uh, now we'll keep this guy in. Medium Ash. Ugh. Okay, he's going with Razor Wind. Which shouldn't do anything to us if we, if we don't knock him out because we are a fire type. And he's gone anyway. Oh, no, he's not either. He lived on one. Oh my goodness. I got a crit there, which I would have got that last time. And down he goes, 76. Yeah, Hope's going to be one of our great players, hopefully. Stop giving me a Pokey to have numbers. I don't want them. Alright, so I'm going to get someone else some experience. Let's get Rita in here this time for sure. Let's uh, heal you up. Yeah, I went to my storage earlier and I was like seeing something. I was like, why is there a potion in my storage? I didn't understand that. Oh, see, this is why I don't like Pokey Nav at all. At all. Oh, it's a double battle. That's great. I didn't pay attention. Not too keen on devil battles. But we should be able to take these guys out. I got two Pokemon each. A Kyogre and a Swallow. Yeah, I kind of need to... Uh, I didn't tell you. And not running. Pretty sure Silverwind knocks out um, Kyogre. Of course, you're going to leave seed. That did. Ooh, that did a lot for the critical. That was a big critical. That's what we call, I guess, a high roll critical. Battle throw. Okay, did nothing. Yeah, you could have some of your health back, but hopefully, the next Iron Tail will knock you out. Doubt it, though. Nope. So win that for the win, please. No, oh, no, it wasn't that. What was it? I faced the Kyogre before. That's Razor Leaf. That's right. I'm pretty sure it was Razor Leaf. And it did knock it out. Lives on one. Oh, you are annoying. Hit you there. And we're going to Razor Leaf. I'll knock them both out, probably. Yeah, it was Razor Leaf, that's right. Take them both out. Right? It lived on one? Kyogre lived on one on a... That makes no sense. How do you live on one? From a very effective move... And you have almost no health. That makes no sense. Let the razor leave. Please knock them both down. That just makes no sense. Okay, that did nothing. And what else you got? A Sneasel. Okay, I could have started off with that. Okay. You're living on one. Why? Alright, well, we're gonna have to heal up Rita so Rita doesn't get, you know, ex out of here. I wanna see what it evolves into. Here goes fine for now. I'm about that razor leaf again. Mock punch. Does nothing. But that was a crit. Okay. I, I'll, I'll believe you later. See, that's how you should be knocked out if it's a super effective move. And that did nothing. You are really becoming annoying. Sod and a razor leaf should knock this thing out. Living on one, like, what is that? That's gonna hurt, isn't it? Not really, and that's another crit, which that one I can believe. The first one, not so much. And the Mr. Bits goes down. Sweet.
Alrighty, that. That was a uh, that was just a pain in the butt. I need to go get potions here in a bit. Okay, so I believe we have this guy to face, and then we're at the cave, right? Ugh. I think I'm doing something out of order. I'm pretty sure there's a gym in that other town, but I didn't see it. Besides, not gonna take it down. You're gonna mean low queen, which means I can't leave, of course, which is fine. Cause I'll facade you down and goodbye. Some Moltres. Moltres? Come on, man. And of course you have Grass Whistle. Oh, that's annoying. That's annoying as can be. And you're gonna Giga Drain. Since I knocked out the other Pokemon, is Mean Look still a thing? No, okay. Giga Drain. You are so annoying. Silver win this thing for the win, please. Oh, that is beautiful. And it did not live on one. Okay. How many badges do I have again? I have what? Four? Three. Yeah, I'm missing the fourth badge, which I think is... Okay, so I need to go back, get potions and everything. I will join you guys here in a second. We are back, everyone's healed up, and we're already going to this cave. We do get an encounter. Let's see what we're going to get. We're going to go up here and just see what happens. And it is going to be a Corsola. I'm sorry, a fortress. Why did I say Corsola? I'm so stupid. Level 18. Let's just go with the poison sting here. It's got detect. Okay, I kind of figured it was going to do that. I shouldn't do much. Still didn't do much, of course it wasn't going. And that's what we wanted. Now what's great about this is if we do catch it, and that's a counter, it will go to the box and we don't have to worry about healing it. So we're actually going to go and we're going to try and throw a great ball. Let's go. That's our fortress. It's ours now. It's going to add to the Pokedex. Yes, we're going to nickname Fortress. It does not evolve because it is a Fortress, and we're going to call it... Uh, what am I going to call it? We're going to call it... If I can get the thing to go, right? Guardian. I hope I spelled that right. So yeah, we do have ourselves a fortress now. What is this Pokeball? Full heal. Cool. Definitely gonna did use one of those. Fun fact, when I was young, I always I, I, I always I never got the I never got the understanding. And there's a Lugia, we could have had a Lugia. But yeah, let's not do that. But I never understand why you have full restore and full heal. It's got the name heal in it. Shouldn't it heal you up, like, your health, too? It's got Endure, which that would have been great. Didn't do much at all. Really gotta be careful with Alugia, though. Gonna hit the facade, it's gonna Endure. Which, that's gonna get annoying. Kinda had a Lugia, but we don't get a Lugia. Is 
Is it only having to? Which if it has, the only thing it has is Endure. I think, what, there's 10 PP for Endure? Iron Iron Tail. It's got Heat Wave. Of course you do. That hurts. Sandstorm Rage is on. Uh, we're just gonna get a Super Potion out here. Yeah, I used to always think, oh, I'm gonna use a full heal, but nah. I, I never understood that. Sandstorm should, I think, oh, okay, yeah, I don't think it can do, endure when it's this low of health. That should knock it out, actually. It didn't. How do you, how do these Pokemon keep living on one? And that's gonna hurt a little bit. But that was a crit. Thank goodness. I didn't mean, I, I forgot I wasn't doing that, but it was a Lugia. I had to get that experience. Okay, so, yeah, that's the last thing we're going to battle like that. Like I said, I don't really want to do that because it does take up time. I want to get through the story as fast as possible, as good as possible. And there is Team Magma. So, yes, we're going to take on Team Magma now. Or Team Aqua. What's going on here? So, what the? So, what am what? Okay, like I said, I've never played Emma before, so I don't have any idea what I'm doing. Like, I have no idea what the story is here. I don't know what happens here. All I know is, what was that? I'm gonna talk to you. Cosmo, I'm a professor. He might have asked me to guide in the meteor falls, but they tricked me and they took the meteor away and they, they okay. So I guess we're off the Mount Chimney, I guess. I'm gonna see what's else in here. Mill tank, that could be an interesting one to have, especially if it has rollouts. Ugh, roll out mill tank. It's such an annoyance. Oh, and I can't escape. That that's just great. And it's got water spell. Oh uh, yeah, I'm just gonna get out of here. I can't escape. Why can't I escape? We're bringing Hugo. You don't want me to escape? I'll escape one way or another. Oh, that's bad. Oh, wait a minute. Psychic hurts poison, not bug. My bad. Tell me I can't escape, Milk Tank. What's wrong with you? I'm not even gonna try it. Let's get, so let's just get out of here. Am I supposed to go down? Or am I, I'll figure that out later. Okay, so we have to go to Mount Chimney. Now I'm pretty, I'm, I'm, like I said, I'm not really too keen sure I'll have to I'll look at something later, or like, during the day. Because I'm taping this the day before. I'll make sure I figure out what's going on with that, or how we're supposed to go. But... That is going to be the end of this episode. If you enjoyed this episode, make sure you hit that subscribe button, comment down below. Let me know it, what is your favorite shiny Pokemon. I like shiny Shinx, shiny pa Ponyta... Uh, think of other ones off the top of my head that I can't think of. Shiny, um, Azumarill is awesome. Of course, Shiny Mew is also a great Shiny. Wish I could have got that Shiny, but yeah. That is going to be all for this episode. Hit that subscribe button, comment down below, like or dislike this video, and I will see you guys on Wednesday, on th Friday for the next episode. Until then, my name is the Face Pokemon, and you guys have a good one.